Okay, oh so God. we were just discussing that the short ones are harder. Right? <laughs> um, somehow. Because <laughs> there's, there's like less to do somehow. So they, uh, they're they wondering how long it takes an investment to double if the interest rate is 9%. P.S. If you can get anything that returns 9%, buy it. For real. Yeah. Stocks don't do 9%. Stocks do like three and a half or something. Like that or something. So. I don't know. I've watched the price the doesn't Street. matter. It's the it's the rate of increase that it's the thing you want to watch with stocks. So we need so the port. What's the mm -hmm. model? Port, port, port. thing. Port. Port. And just to annoy Ethan, we'll use P's. Yeah. Ha! Take that. If you want to use the A's, does it make any difference at all? No. no. And in fact, it might be a good idea to not write this as population. But fuck that. Okay, so what's the, where's the interest? Where's your growth rate? Your rate is 9%. Okay, so here's your growth rate. What's your starting amount? P. 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 What do you mean it's P0? It's what do you mean? What do you mean? How long does it take to double? Oh, it's two T's. Yeah, you don't know how much you invested. That seems like a fundamental error on your part, but whatever, <laughs> right? So, we just need a way to write, I don't know. So, what's your initial amount if you don't know? Ten? Or one? P zero. Okay. Or one. Yeah, one also works fine. Okay. So, right, this is the, what's this one hand that I'm writing down? Is this the model or the stuff they told me? It's the stuff you told me about the model. I'm going to write the model Ooh. first. Okay. So what's the model say? I've got some starting amount, and then e, e, an e, and then what's your r? 0 0.09. And then t. And t. You were doing problem 11 or something. Oops. And then, so this is on the one hand, right, the model. And on the other hand, what they told you. Yeah, so what they told me is 2p. Double? P to the 2. So, 2P not? Why not 2P? <laughs> 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 that is the question. That was horrible. Okay. <laughs> so then what? <laughs> Divide both sides by? P not. P not. You might wish to spend a second wondering if P not is 0. Right? In which case, dividing by zero would be a bad idea. Oh. That's telling you, right, that if you invest zero dollars, of course, it will never, in fact, double. <laughs> right? I gotta go talk to my financial planner. <laughs> okay, so I've got two is e to the point zero nine t. Then what? Natural log that shit. Yeah, natural log that thing. Natural log this stuff. <laughs> So if you log this stuff, you'll have natural log of two, two is 0 0.09, times 0.09 times t, and then what? Divide by 0 0.09. Divide by 0.09. You guys might notice these are always going to be exactly the same steps, right? Yes. You're going to divide through by the p naught. You're going to log both sides, and then you're going to divide by either r or t. So I'm got t is log of 2 over 0 0.09. Mm -hmm. This looks familiar. What would you get? 7.7. Uh, 7.7. 7. 7. Because it's the same numbers as before. Oh, it's the same numbers from the last problem? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because the last problem was about nine years and we were supposed to find the rate, right? Here, we had an interest rate of 9%, and we were supposed to find the years. We probably could have called that if we had been smarter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. I tried to circle that, but that's wrong. What do you need to do? Write a paragraph. OK, so you need to write a paragraph with an introductory <laughs> statement. Stating your thesis. And a thesis. And a middle filler statement. And the conclusion. Evidence. So what do you write here? 
Good How long is it to double? The investment will double in the city of Missouri. Yeah. Investment will double in 7.7 .7 <laughs> years. Investment double in... <laughs> yeah, I suppose I should use the same awkward English. Double <laughs> in 7.7 .7 years. Investment does. Is this going to be 9% oh. long <laughs> double? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was really my paraphrasing that got bad English. Oh, wasn't it last week? You guys cool? Do you have any questions on this? So, what's the hard part on these? It's not this, by the way. No, it's reading and understanding and how to convince Yeah, read and understand this, and then it's for the solving ones. On the one hand, there's the model. On the other hand, there's the stuff they told you. For funsies. For funsies. Long way off. I don't know if this would ever apply to what we're doing. But what if the P not was at a different location? Like we're starting at a different spot. So we don't know. You know what I mean? Would it be any different? You can always set the time scale to agree, right? Okay. So, for instance, this time scale starts at P naught, right? Right. Would it be like P three? We started at three. Then you'd say, okay, P naught, and then you'd call your time, whatever your old time was, plus three. Ah. Okay. See that? Yeah. This this one works where P naught and T is zero agree. All you yeah, I really would advise that you just call wherever you're starting zero. And then if you get a negative T, that means that it happened a while ago. Okay. Good enough. You guys see that? So you're always going to use P naught? You're not going to ever use, like, is that just a label? Yeah, it's just a label for the starting amount. So. But if you knew, like. You know, if you have a population that does something like this, right? Like, if your starting population is 800 and you're asking when did it hit 600, and the, P the same thing works. It's just that you're going to get a T is negative. Okay. <laughs>